And you still some snow out there, I see behind you. Yeah, absolutely. Buell's Gore right now. This is a look there. You can see the snow is falling. The camera's picking it up and there's still snow on the ground. That's higher elevations again. Green Mountains again, higher elevations of Chittenden County and then into the Adirondacks too. So everyone in those higher elevations at least has that chance for the showers for the next couple of hours. You can see they're tapering off though in the Adirondacks and still kind of holding strong in the western slopes of those Green Mountains and probably even a couple of those little flurries flying along the Canadian border. So. That's all thanks to that same low pressure system we've been talking about for over a week now. It's sitting just to the north of us, and as it brings in that air, wraps it around, it's going to be moving over the mountains, which is why those western slopes of the Green Mountains will have some showers this morning and probably some this afternoon as well. And of course, it keeps a lot of those clouds around too. There's a high pressure system trying to take back over, but this low is being stubborn. This high pressure system will bring us some sunshine at times today and into tomorrow, but again, the low is going to hold steady for the next couple of days and we will see clouds out of that. It's cold as well. It's wrapping around that colder air, that low, and that puts us near 36 degrees to start in Burlington, 33 in Plattsburgh, 30 degrees in Saranac Lake, 34 in Montpelier, 32 in Newport, 36 in Rutland. So it's a little chilly out there to start, and it does get better, at least a couple degrees better than it was yesterday. 47 by about noontime. We'll see a few stray spotty showers in the afternoon, but we're really starting to dry up. Highs will be in the low 50s by around 4 or 5 o'clock. Here are those stray showers. Again, as you can see, future casts not showing a whole lot of that. It is mostly rain in those lower elevations especially, but there's some sunny moments in between and more of those for tomorrow. Here's your Wednesday morning and afternoon. Obviously, the clouds are showing up. Northeast Kingdom has the best chance for any of that leftover rain, but you also get a little bit of that sunshine in between. Just count on there being clouds at times between today, tomorrow, Thursday, and don't rule out a stray shower as well those couple of days. The temperatures very slowly starting to warm up. Going to be in the low 60s, drier on Friday, but then the rain returns for Saturday night and throughout your Mother's Day. We are expecting kind of a damp end to the weekend and start of next work week.